This is not the news, and you guessed it. I'm G, your host, and we're fixing to have some more news here. As soon as we're... okay, just about got it. Just about. Let's see what we got here. News. All right. Paul Allen. Paul Allen is one of the co-founders of Microsoft with Bill Gates. He's passed away now. So during this time, when he was spending a lot of money, since he had billions of dollars, he bought, no, had a ship built called uh, Octopus, 414 foot long. Now that's, that is, that's just gigantic, you know? And uh, two helicopter pads on it, a pool, and two submarines. You can't just drive one submarine. You need two submarines. <laughs> and a side hatch to where it had uh, mini jet skis. You know, you got to have some fun. Since it has been used a lot by celebrities on parties and everything on the yacht, it's like, even at a huge discount, even getting the, the cobwebs off my money, I still, I, it's still too much money. I'm going to have to pass for that one right now. So now, onward to some more news. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah, F1, F1 race cars. You know, it's like uh, they're, they're, they're racing around the world. He's, very expensive race cars, and they're having to pay those drivers exorbitant amount of money per race. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, now the F1, uh, the that owns F1, the, the corporate people, they put a cap on each team, a cost cap. In other words, don't spend no more than 145 million per year. Now, the Williams team did not get their documentation in time, so they had to pay a fine of $25,000. So the F1 is saying, okay, we're going to drop the price of uh, the cost cap to $140 million, from $145 million to $140 million to help the competitors. Like, that's really going to help them with the deep pockets for all the sponsors? Yeah, right. It's like get it down to one million for the guys that don't have that kind of money to get out there and race with them. That would help right there. But no, they're not going to do that. No, oh no. I'd work through some more news. Now, I don't know if you've heard about the Rush, 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 Russian oligarchs, <laughs> those billionaires that are friends with Putin. You know what? We got some more news here about them Russian oligarchs. Okay, what we got here? We got here. We got here. It's like uh, the U.S. has taken ownership of a Russian oligarch's uh, three hundred and fifty million dollar yacht. It's parked in the Fiji Islands. That Russian, whoever owned it, hauled ass down there. Told the captain, said, "Haul ass down there to Fiji Islands and go hide that sucker." But no, the U.S. found it, you know. So let me see, let me see, let me see. You know what? Since the Russian oligarchs are giving those yachts away, I think it's time that I need, I need to go seize one myself. I need to find out where they're parking them things and uh, slip a $20 bill to the captain and say, hey, hey, send it all over here to Texas. Yeah, I need a yacht today. You know what? <laughs> That's our news. Read my lips. Meow. <laughs>